new society members join societies um, really primarily in the early stages of their career to advance their career um, and for professional development purposes. And a career centre embodies that, you know, whether it be looking for uh, mentoring opportunities, careers news, careers advice, finding job opportunities. Um, you know, a career centre delivers really uh, their primary motivation uh, for signing up to the society in the first place. The number one indicator of successful career centre is, uh, is revenue. Um, and not just because of the financial aspect, um, because that revenue is a very good indicator of the engagement that that career centre has with its community. Um, and career centres are all about community. So if advertisers are paying, it means that they, well, the career centre is providing access to a highly talented uh, group of professionals um, that they don't necessarily or they can't come across elsewhere. So people might go to a job board because they are actively looking for a job at any one time. They go to a career centre because they're part of a community, because they're researching, for a number of reasons. But career centres aid and, and deliver passive candidates, which are very high value to, to recruiters, and of course um, help the, the people who visit them to further their careers. Career centres are more than job boards. They provide engagement and a real member benefit. Many academic societies and professional associations provide career centres for their members, 